Welcome back to Trend Buzz's Love Island Reactions, episode 15. Tonight was pretty good, to be honest. Um, first of all, let's talk about this whole India, Dami and Ikenna triangle. Ikenna is weird. Like, did you see when they're chatting and he's sticking his tongue out and making noises? Like, it's like he's got like a nervous Tourette's where he just sticks his, goes, ah. But anyways, um, I'm glad that India basically put an end to things because it was stale and it had always been stale and you could just tell they weren't into each other. But I'm surprised that how Berets and Dami was like, he was actually like, okay, but what about us? Like, he was, what do you think of me? Like, he went straight in. And obviously, like, you can also tell that he wants a girl who's going to give him back and India wants the same. And do you know what? Before, I wasn't all that... I wasn't sold on the idea, but I see them together now, like, they're actually really cute, like, how they're talking, and they just get on so much better than with anyone else, so, like, I'm here for that, like, but I do feel like he needs to do like, the right thing and talk to Amber about it and I like, care about it, and then proceed, because, yeah, I mean, even if Amber's even here, maybe they'll both go home tomorrow and then they won't have this problem. But yeah, it was a bit, it was a bit, it was a bit cute. Like, I'm a bit excited for potential what could happen between the two of them. Um, and even the way Amber was talking to Dami, like, she was like, okay, just do it and stop talking. Like, she's so rude to, like, everyone in such a sly way. And I've always seen that. And that's why I've never been a fan of her. And I've never bigged her up on her. But yeah, and then the argument with Ekansu. Okay, so first of all, Ekansu is actually, a, like, I'm loving the drama, but you know she's actually a snake because her man, like, like Jane, confiding her, like, I think these girls don't like you, and then she went straight. And she was like, oh, really? Then went straight to the girls and was like, Jane pissed me off. He said this, this, that, and we're like, this girl has loyalties to no one, bro. Not even herself. Not even her mother. She has <laughs> loyalties. And then like, Amber was being real with her, um, which. Amber's going to be, isn't she? So, that was fine. And Gemma was being real with her, which I'm surprised because Emma acts like they're best friends. So, if you're so close, why didn't you tell her this before? But, yeah, anyways. And then Ekin Sue tried to flip it on Amber, get aggressive. And then when she thought that all the girls weren't on her side, she then brought out the actress tears. Like, she, she's hilarious. And I'm surprised she's in the bottom three because... She's actually been bringing us, like, entertainment these past couple of weeks. So, like, I don't want her to go home. I'd rather Amber go home because she's boring and she's rude. And Tasha, I think Tasha and Andrew were very shocked they were in the bottom. And I was shocked because I thought people really liked them. Like, to me, they're quite boring and stale. But, like, they're, they're pretty secure. And I thought everyone liked them. I don't know, guys. Let me know your thoughts on them. But yeah, I'm surprised they're in the bottom. Um, Ikenna is like really weird and boring, so I'm not surprised at that. Ekasu, I was like, okay, cool. People probably don't like her. Um, Jay, no one likes him because he's just like a, he's bitchy. Like he goes and puts ideas in people's heads and he thinks he's like the therapist. Um, yeah, so I, I'm interested like to see who the public have chosen to go home. So guys, let me know down below your thoughts on tonight's episode and who you think is leaving tomorrow and come back same time tomorrow so we can discuss <laughs> thank you for watching